I don't know why, but y'all love this. Y'all love this conversation. Oh, y'all was in them comments telling me off, boy. I had that, hey, I got that that audio. I'm about to play it again on this one. When Joe Button went at Poetic Flacco from uh, No Jumper, but oh, y'all like this. I like it too. No Jumper. Wow, No Jumper versus the Joe Button podcast. Let's listen to the audio. I got the I got the pictures of them down there so y'all can see what's going on. Who's on who's who's the cast? Let's listen. Let's listen again. Let's let's tap back in. Where that shit at? Here you go. A hey, hey, Flacco, respectfully, and this is with all due respect. You come from no jumper land, which is BMX land in my brain. You niggas ain't hip hop. Don't know nothing about hip hop, and y'all get y'all rules and y'all moral compass from other y'all operate off other principles. I right. right there. This is what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say the same. I'm basically the same thing, and this is what I'm saying. Right there, I feel what Joe Button saying, but he he's talking to Poetic Flacco. He's not talking to uh, Adam Twenty Two. But what he's saying is meant for Adam Twenty Two because look, let's see. If you look over here, we have uh, your boy Suspect. He's not a biker. He's not a BMXer. Wax 100. He's not a biker. He's not a BMXer. Lush. He's not a biker. He's not a BMXer. Brick Baby. He's not a. He's not a biker. He's not a BMXer. Uh, Sharp. He's not a biker. He's not a BMXer. Hudder Flacco, the one he was actually talking to. On, uh, on this audio, it's not a biker and not it's not a BMXer. Uh, there's a there's a person missing. Uh, there's a couple people missing, but uh, DW Flame is not a biker. It's not a BMXer. Adam Twenty Two is the only biker. Like on, he's the only biker. So let me rewind this. It's that that, that first twenty two seconds. Let's listen again. Joe Button's talking to Pilot Flacco, but he's really talking about Adam 22 when he's saying this. And this is not really the in the big argument of Joe Button podcasts over here versus No Jumper. It's not really in the argument of that. This is a shot at, at Adam 22. Listen again. Listen again. So y'all won't be in them comments telling me I don't know what I'm talking about. Listen again to what they're actually talking about. Then we're going to talk about the the, the programs against each other. A hey, hey, Flacco, respectfully, and this is with all due respect, you come from no jumper land, which is BMX land in my brain. You niggas ain't hip hop, don't know nothing about hip hop. And y'all get y'all rules and y'all moral compass from other y'all operate off other principles. So we anything that, you, anything that any of you uh, no jumper niggas got to say about you out of control. hip hop related <laughs> matters. Like well, needs to well, come we more hip hop than you, Joe. But why get the fuck out of here? Y'all are doing. And that's what I had to. That's what I started. And I'm laughing again because that's funny, yo. Poeta Flacco trying to trying to pump up his chest to Joe Button is hilarious to me. I don't know how y'all don't think that is funny as fuck, man. He don't really got no uh yo, Joe Button is hip hop. Okay? Like he so it's like him saying anything hip hop to him is it's just funny. It got it make me chuckle. It do, it do. So, don't be delusional just yeah. for hey, in terms of battle rap, right? Hey, Lock Flacco, on, I won't Flacco even dig about this stupid shit that you just said, but let's not be delusional just for the sake of argument. If yeah. I said pop is yeah, and that's and that's and that's what I also think. Poetic Flacco, he is he loved to be delusional in the sake of winning the argument. I don't, I don't and and Joe Button didn't get wrapped up in that. A lot of people get wrapped up in when somebody decide to go so like bizarre just to make a point. When it's like, yo, we talking about this right here, yo. And what Joe Button is saying is. Your podcast ain't more hip hop than my podcast. Let's have that conversation. Let let me play it a little more. Then we won't have that conversation. We won't have two conversations because they're separate. Which 
No, let's fuck it. Let's just have let's just have what podcast is more hip hop conversation after this. Hip hop is Melissa yes, Ford. Hip hop and how is ice. that cast more hip hop than than on um, um no, no I have to respect your opinion on who you believe is more informed. Cool. There's people who like, who will say, listen, I don't give a fuck about what Ice is, Queen Slip, or Melissa Ford has to say about hip hop, and they will be validated in their opinion. I'm just saying, right from my opinion. Joe Budden cast of niggas ain't with us. All of, that, all of that is awesome. And that's the great thing about YouTubers and their right to opinions. Certain things can't be argued because they're etched in stone in the record books, documented as fact. Mm. Parks was just Grammy nominated last year. Let's and WAP 100 has a multi site like foolish. Albums. Let's not be fooled. Whack 100 is in the music business. So I'm talking. All right. Yeah. Hey, hey, hold up. In that part, a lot of people was in the comments on the last video and had something to say when I said that I felt like Joe Button was reaching when he brought Parks up. Y'all, it sounds like I feel like y'all skipped what I said right beside that. I said your point was too strong to say that. Now, let me break down what I, what I mean by when I say he was reaching. Maybe I didn't mean to say he was reaching to be exactly. What I'm saying is this. When we talk about the cast, yes, Parks is part of the cast today. But I feel like at the beginning, Parks was an engineer off the mic, off, off, off the uh, camera guy. He was like, he was not part of the cast cast until today. You know what I mean? Like, until he got reinvented. When it was Joe Button podcast before, when it was uh, it was Joe Button, Rory, Ma, it was like that. Until it starts switching up, then Parks wiggled up more to the more to the uh, front of the scene with a lot of more people. So it's like and you could I forgot to put your boy. Uh, you could put Imani over there. You could put you could put him over there. Yeah, you could put your boy Freaky E over there. With the uh, Joe Button podcast too, so that's that we're gonna talk. We could add him into the hip hop a por portion of that crew because we're gonna add DW Flame to the No Jumper side. All right, so all right, let's let's talk about it right now. Fuck it, let's let's break it down. Oh no, let no no. Let me wrap up what I was saying about the park shit. Yes, we can include it today. We could include it today, but where I was coming from when I say he was reaching from it, I'm saying like. His point was already strong. I feel like, yeah, like I'm about to explain it in depth, but I feel like, yeah, the Joe Bunn podcast is way more hip hop than No Jumper podcast in depth. But I'm saying I ain't think I ain't feel like he had to go to Parks first because it's like I don't feel like he hired Parks originally to be on screen talent for hip hop. You know, understand what I'm saying? All of these people. That that Adam is hiring or getting literally picked to be on screen talent for hip hop. I'm telling you this. I'm telling you this. All right. So look. Uh, well, not all of them. Like ninety percent of them. It seemed like Joe Button's podcast is today is more so. Look, let, I'll talk about that after this. That's what I mean when I say the park situation. Parks is hip hop, and yes, he is part of the cast today. So now let's talk about that. Let's talk about Joe Button podcast versus No Jumper podcast. Who's more hip hop? Let's put people up against people. Let's talk about these motherfuckers. First of all, all right. Let's talk about let's talk about the uh, who I think ain't the stronger. All right, I'm gonna talk about them first. No Jumper podcast is not more hip hop, but. A lot of people in the comments was discrediting them, so I gotta I gotta bring up how they are hip hop, and how it is. It's, it, that debate can't be like y'all can't say it's like blown out of the blown out of the water because look, all of JoJo's points is going to come from Adam, and it's Adam is one person of, and there's a lot of people on this fucking podcast or this or this fucking cast or whatnot. So first. You got your boy, sir, uh, suspect suspect is a rapper. His dad was, is, a is, is big on, is a under, I, I don't know if he's underground or he was a, uh, West coast rapper, but 
the nigga is in hip hop, all right? So that's one person that's hip hop over there. Then you got Wack 100. Wack 100. He's hip hop. He fucking, what? He's managed the game. Blueface. Uh, who else he managed? He probably managed some other people, but uh, Ray J. Come on, man. He's hip hop. All right. Lush. He, he's big on the battle rap scene. Like, look up Lush one on the battle rap scene. You will find out. Do your homework. So he's hip hop. Uh, Brick Baby. The nigga fucking Brick Baby's a, literally an artist, just like Suspect. So he's hip hop. <laughs> I mean, all right. Your boy, Sharp, he's more so, I, I feel like originally he was more so there for like, the, uh, have conversations with females. So I don't feel like he was hired up on there to be hip hop talent, like a talent for the hip hop shit. Even though, I mean, he's a nigga, he, he, he's a nigga, he, he could pop it, he gonna pop his hip hop shit because he's probably been listening to it his whole life. So, but I'm gonna I'm a give, I'm not gonna count him as a strong suit for no hip hop shit over there. All right, so uh, as far as I know, anyway. But uh, Poetic Flacco, the nigga is a fucking hip hop journalist. Basically, he just studied hip fucking hip hop all day. So you gotta say he got he's a, he, he's count for some hip hop. And Adam Twenty Two, he is more so like Sharp. I will put him on that level of like he's not a strong suit for the hip hop. I want to put him into the strong suit. Definitely not for the cast that I'm about to turn. <laughs> not me talk about. All right, so on the other side, the Joe Button podcast side, there's Parks, Grammy nominated, Grammy winner, or fucking he make beats, engineering shit. He, bro, he, he hip hop, he's hip hop, and he's a strong person in this conversation for this. Yes. All right, Melissa Ford, video hip hop video vixen. So she been she been on hip hop a lot, but I don't think she was hired for hip hop. Exactly. And on most of the hip hop content, she normally she's normally quiet, but I, I like I have to put her on the same level as like how I put it on the other side. How I put what put short because it's like yeah, she know hip hop, but was I don't, I'm not sure if she was hired for. Well, she's not giving up, giving up like she's like so much of a, a fan of hip hop where she's like giving out super deep dialogue. But she's hip hop. She's hip hop, man. Right, we gonna count fucking Melissa Ford as hip hop. What are you shit me? All right. So your boy, Flip, Queens Flip. He's fucking hip hop. Like his name's Queens Flip. He fucking like he's black. He's like it's hard to say niggas ain't hip hop, right? <laughs> like the niggas hip hop. Queens Flip. He do. He's into the battle rap scene, just like Lush. Uh, and he's hip hop. All right. So next, Joe Button. It's hip hop, but come on, we ain't got too much to say about Joe. We ain't got, we ain't got to pump it up. No pun intended. All right, uh, ish. He knows hip hop too, but what I call him a strong suit. No, he's just a good. He's a good. He's a Joe Button's friend and a good debater in general. Know what I mean? I feel like know what I mean he could he could debate anything. Know what I mean, all right, and uh, your boy Ice. Ice, yeah, he's uh his brother's a battle rapper, so he he and he's deep into the hip hop. Like he's a journalist. He's the journalist. If you ask me, not he don't. I don't know if he dig deep, but he just know he 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 do the homework as it come, and he always do. do he all. It seemed like he always have. You feel me? It seemed like he always did the homework as it came. So he's like he knows shit. He's organized his music. He I, I would say he's deep in it, like uh poetic flocker when it comes to like. Hip hop on that side, as far as like knowing shit as well. Uh, so, Joe Button podcast versus No Jumper. It's, it's, it sounds simple to me. The No Jumper podcast is stronger when it comes to hip hop, period. But on a, on, a, on a weird tip, No Jumper covers basically just hip hop. And Joe Button podcast covers hip hop, or uh, R and B, movies, culture in general. You know what I mean, they like, like so. It's like these motherfuckers over here is just trying to like be like so hip hop. 
and uh, Adam do some other shit, but that's not the no jumper shit. The no jumper shit, if you ask me, normally it's like it's like gangbang culture and hip hop, and the no jumpers is just is 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 more broad, but on the back end, they are more hip hop. Now let me play the rest of this clip, and we gonna get up out of here. About you dirty, and he's hip hop though, right? Niggas. Yeah, no, no, I'm not no, no, talking no. about him. I'm talking so, about you bike riding niggas. Don't they don't ride. have any bikers right, giving takes. You know you're though. wrong, Joe. Again, nah, though, Flacco, we talk about wrong, for cash. I'm telling you is this, nigga. If you got parts, we got whack. Now, again, let's go down the line. Queen Flip ain't do an iota in battle rap that Lush One did in battle rap. That's just a fact. You can line up Ice, Ish, and Melissa Ford. They not fucking with Flacco alone. You feel me? Feel me? Oh, it's not shit. happening. Right? So, so again, though. Joe Budden oh, has a nuts. cast. He's Joe nuts. Budden has a cast, right? Of Nick. Yeah. And that was that. And the heat is on. We see it bubbling. No jumper versus Joe Budden podcast. In them comments, tell me how y'all feel. Who y'all feel? Who y'all feel is more hip hop? I feel like Joe Budden podcast is more hip hop than no jumper. That is what it is. From the core. From the core, but can't count them niggas out because they is hip hop over there.